Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you step by step process how you can easily integrate HubSpot with Gmail. So let's start. First way is when you come here to App Marketplace and you just see Gmail here and you can integrate it through directly HubSpot. But many, some people are going to say that it's not working so you can use also Zapier here. So what you can do is just simply connect app here and I'm going to add to Chrome HubSpot sales. Yes. Okay, and we see it right here. That mamma mia. So, login, you can access different tools and features depending on the permissions you give HubSpot. Choose your experience for my mail. Limited features, email tracking, details about your contacts, outgoing emails logged to the CRM, or you can have all features here, right? Connect. Now I'm going to, in this interactive tour, you will learn how to send a tracked email and let's click compose mail. So right now, track, you see uh, that we have the add-on and turn on the track to get notified when the recipient opens or clicks this email. So I can track to associate this email with other records, click on the record link to select the other records the email will be associated with send your tracked email, send this email and you'll receive a browser notification when the recipient opens it. This is like huge. Okay. Pro. Done. And now you can go to, go to user guide, how to use it. And then, then you will have like uh, the company and when you're going to have a new contact, you can simply add it. And this is beautiful, right? I see the all contacts here. And now I can open in CRM. I can call the person, right? So that's how we would see it right here. Let's click compose. And now I can go with a Jessica. And then I can schedule send. Then I can log in. So that's what we can do, right? I'm just going to write the mail here. This email will be tracked, so we can open and click notification. You can see the templates here. If you have any templates, uh, you can use that. Then you have sequences here. Uh, you can attach documents from HubSpot and meeting and snippets that you have. And then you just simply send it. So this is the first way how we can do it and how we can connect HubSpot with Gmail. The second way how we can do it is to create a Zap. So you could come here and make a Zap. And this is like really similar process. So uh, let me show you this way. Dashboard, HubSpot. Now uh, you come here and connect it with Gmail. And when there is going to be a new contact in list or let's say new contact. Then in Gmail, you can simply send email, right? Try it. And now what do you want to do? Let me show you. So I'm going to choose the account, press continue. Then you just can add and add additional properties. You need to also verify your uh, HubSpot account with Zapier. Press continue. Now I'm going to test the trigger now. So create a new contact in your. I can skip the test. Okay. You just have to create a new contact in HubSpot to see this. Continue. And now choose an app and event. So I'm going to choose Gmail and action event send mail. Continue. Choose account. Okay, I'm going to choose mine here. I can reconnect here. So. Okay, continue. And now to who you want it to send new contact in HubSpot. So test mail, right? Then CC if you want it to send it to someone like your colleague or something. BCC from and my name, my 
of Gmail. Enter name, reply to, subject, you add a body type, signature and everything. And this is the really cool way how you can uh, connect to the end, integrate and make, make your own zaps. So if you have any questions, guys, ask me down below in the comments. I'll be really happy to help you. And this is how you can actually combine AppSpot with Gmail. Thank you. Have a great day and goodbye.